Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I'm going to be doing a random pick a card reading. This your girl Lady Tarot T. I am back at it again with another one. So we got three piles, pile one, pile two, and pile three. Timestamps are going to be down below. Don't forget to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel. All right. Um, keep in mind, you know that this is a general reading. Not everything in this reading is going to resonate with you, okay? So just keep that in mind. This is a random reading, okay? So I've randomly pulled these cards with no, you know, specific question. <laughs> We're just going to see what message comes through from spirit, you know? And if this happens to resonate with you, like, share, and subscribe. Let's go ahead and get into it. For those of you who chose Pile 1, let's go ahead and get into your random message. Alright, so let's see what messages Spirit has. So you have doubt. You have guilty. Blameworthy. Res um, responsible and at fault. You have Spirit of Time. Illusion. Endless waiting. You have balance. One person is giving too much in this relationship. You have long distance. Oh, somebody knows that they are wrong here is what I'm getting. You have anticipation. Oh, erotic activation. Masculine. Okay, so somebody definitely could have been giving too much in a connection in a relationship. One person was giving too much. It could be you. Because I'm getting like somebody is feeling guilty. They know that they were at fault. Maybe due to a breakup. I'm getting long distance. We have the Six of Swords. Wow. Let's just travel across water. A lot of water energy here. <laughs> so some of y'all could be a water sign. I'm getting a lot of water energy. Yeah. Um, we got the nine of wands. Interesting. I feel like somebody feels guilty here. Um, something that they did. Yeah, somebody did something and now they, I mean, they feel guilty. Like they, they know that they're at fault here. I'm getting like some time has passed. We, we have spirit of time, illusion, endless, and waiting. Somebody hasn't spoken their peace or somebody hasn't spoken up here i'm getting this is a connection a relationship that was but is no longer um this person is either you could have traveled or distanced yourself from this person but i feel like they could be wanting to come forward towards you there has been some time i feel like this person yes i'm just getting the feeling of somebody feeling really guilty they're kind of like trying to let things cool down or die off. But it's like t time. Yeah, we got spirit of time. But that's just an illusion, though. Like time is. We have the four swords, the high priest. I feel like this person may feel as if you are going to be defensive towards them. With this nine of wands. See how this this like, yeah, that's what I'm getting. Okay, for some, this could be female energy could be a masculine energy I'm, I'm getting both though um but it's like somebody traveling forward and they could be i'm getting somebody hoping that you don't reject them or you don't yeah but i'm getting like with the nine of wands you definitely like in fight mode here with this energy um yeah with this energy so yeah, it's like somebody did something they they know they feel guilt like they feel guilt. Like, yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Somebody is having doubt though that you will accept their apology or something of this of that sort. Because you gave too much to this person here. That's what I'm getting. Um, we have anticipation. I feel like, yeah, this person or you maybe there is a meetup here. Maybe there could be a coming together. For some of you, is what I'm getting. Mending this um, connection is what I'm getting. Yeah. Because there's a lot of um, passion between the two. 
for some of you. Yeah, that's for some of you, not all of you. Um, <laughs> Spirit said that's just for the freaky ones. Okay, yeah, that's the one. Okay, but for others of you, I'm getting like this person maybe having like having a lot of doubt on like mending this connection because whatever they did here, um, you still may hold some sort of a grudge here or something of that sort against this person. But I really feel like for the majority of you, this person wants to work things out with you. Um, because yeah, in this deck, the high priest talks about, yeah, and that's what it talks about too. In this, um, in the guidebook could be some sort of, um, falling out of, you know, you and this person here. And this is talking about like, um, the high priestess energy, the high priest energy to me, it's like bringing two people together and letting kind of like letting each other hear each other out and putting aside their differences with that energy. So that's why I'm getting like this person for some of you. I feel like <laughs> some of y'all are going to be mending this connection. Um, there's a lot of passion, intimate, like hot and heavy energy between the two of you. Is what I'm getting. And that's why this person, this person feels you even in like, like, yeah, that's what I'm getting. So you guys are, that's why this person is feeling guilty because they are, I feel like this person is feeling your energy here. Even though you guys are disconnected, it's like you still are around each other or interesting, very um interesting connection though. Um, I'm getting telepathic. Um... Yeah, telepathic. Thank you, spirit. Because I'm getting, I look down at the four swords. To me, that's like sleeping, resting, um, mentally, mental, mental. Uh, hold on, shit, y'all, yep, hold on. Damn. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, I feel like you guys could be communicating with each other telepathically or some shit like that. Like, yeah, I feel like both of you either feel each other, <clears throat> even though you guys are distant, but I'm getting like, your souls are connected or some shit like that. That's why this person is coming forward towards you. But, I mean, y'all could be meeting up on a different uh, realm. Okay. Uh, this could be in 5D. Fifth dimension. It's like a lot of different. <laughs> I don't know. That's what I'm getting. Somebody astro travels or you guys meet up in another realm here, in another dimension. Not in the physical is what I'm getting here. Okay. Where you guys meet up at time. Ooh. Thank you, spirit. Oh, my goodness. Why did it take me so long to get that out? I don't know why. But I'm getting where you guys meet up at time is, yeah, that's why this is here. Time of, I mean, spirit of time, illusions, endless and waiting. I'm getting where you guys meet up at. There is no time here. I feel like, yeah, because, I mean, damn, damn. But in like in 3D, in the physical, in our physical world, it's like you guys are not in communication. You guys are not talking. <clears throat> yeah. Wow. This is interesting. I feel like some of y'all are definitely like meeting with this person in a different realm. I don't know what, why I'm getting where, where you guys connect and meet. There is no time. Okay. That's why I'm getting like with the four swords, you guys could be like meeting in like different. Now yeah, you could be astro traveling or, whoa, I, I, I want to get out of this energy. Cause I feel like I'm in a different motherfucking, um, <laughs> I feel like I'm in a different, like, I feel like I'm not here. Like, I don't, what the fuck is this? Like, <laughs> what is, what is, what am I caught up in right now? Like, I feel like I'm in a different realm. Like, this is not, like, where you guys meet up at is not in the physical here. You guys are not in contact with each other. Okay, I'm about to tap out of this energy because I don't want to keep going. Like, what the, but in the physical, this person has a lot of doubt that you guys are going to come together. But I'm getting, like, whoever this person is that's at a distance from you, they're, they're being called to you. Like, that's what I'm getting because you guys are meeting or visiting each other, maybe in your dreams here or some shit like that, where you guys are meeting up at. There is no time. That's why I'm, I'm getting like this is on a different fucking room. Like, for those of you who understand here, yeah, your masculine energy could be coming forward towards you. They're, yeah, they're connecting with you 
not in the physical, not in our, you know, that's why I'm getting like with the four swords. You guys could be like with each other in the fifth dimension or, or some other place. Like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> what the fuck is this? Okay. I don't know. I feel like I'm in a dream and in one of those in one of those dreams where it's like um Okay, so this is okay, so sometimes when I when I dream it's like I'm not in the like the real world. I'm 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 like on another fucking level. Like I don't I feel like you guys have a meeting place here. Like you guys have a meeting place on another realm on another dimension not in the physical here but in the in 3d you know it's like your connection is non-existent yeah there's no communication here um but i'm getting like you guys you guys meet up yeah, so I want to get it. I want to get out of here. Listen, do with this information what you will. I don't know. Like, <laughs> okay, fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I'm getting a lot of water energy. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, air, uh, um, um, air energy, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Okay, I feel like this person's going to be coming forward towards you though. In the real world is what I'm getting. But I'm getting like y'all could be like the really defensive towards this person the whole time. Y'all motherfuckers is meeting up in a different realm. Okay, like stop it. <laughs> stop the press. <laughs> stop it. You're gonna be like put like having your guard up, even though I feel like you want this person to come forward. And I'm gonna leave it there. I didn't spend elect but 12 minutes, okay. <laughs> On this, you could be dealing with any sign. This is this is wow. I never experienced this type of uh but yeah, I'm with this pile, y'all motherfuckers took me to a whole place that I ain't even know exist. Okay. <laughs> with this energy. Um, but I'm getting and that could be where that could be where that anticipation comes from because this person wants to fucking come forward towards you in the physical, like in the real world. They like fuck that. I'm tired of meeting up. <laughs> I'm getting like somebody, that's funny, wow. Yeah, it's like somebody is tired tired of meeting up in all of these different fucking realms and all of these different secret doors and shit that y'all be going through. Like, I'm getting somebody is going through different, like, let me, okay, I'm gonna shut it down. It is what it is. For those of you who this resonates with, and y'all already know what the fuck I'm talking about. Um, For others of you who don't know, that's on you. Um, that's why I said I want to get out of this energy because I feel like I'm in a different fucking world. What the fuck is this? Okay. Um, <laughs> yeah, I feel like you guys meet up at some sort of secret place, but this is like, it's not in the physical here. Okay. Yeah. This is on some deep spiritual, uh, telepathic type of shit here. Like I'm getting sex. Uh, that's why I said I'm gonna get out of this energy. Okay, so yeah, this person does. This person is like they are yearning for you, and they are going to be coming forward. That's all I got to say about that. Um, if this one resonates with you in any way, like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> I'll see you next time. All right, you guys. So for those of you who chose pile two, let's see your random message. So you have forceful shy okay timid um hesitant reserved okay what doors did i open this time let's see spirit of the tower uh surprises shifts big changes friendship this friendship is leading to more interesting so we have forceful somebody who's i'm getting like two different energies here okay so we got somebody who's very that's what okay so let me get the rest of this out because we got somebody Somebody's energy who's very forceful, very assertive, um, <clears throat> bold type of energy. And then we have a very shy, timid, reserved type of energy. Interesting. We have Spirit of the Tower. So some sort of surprise or big shift changes. I'm getting friendship. Okay, and this friendship is leading to more. Maybe, yeah, spring. Interesting. What's going on here? Okay. Um, we have lip service. 
you have oh proposition interesting and we have love potential okay so i'm getting friendship so whether you have you have some sort of connection or friend or friendship with this person this could be leading to more that could be the drastic change here or something is happening but then sorry about that you guys um, um definitely um I'm getting a major change, major shift with this tower energy here. Um, maybe this something happens around you or this person that kind of brings you two together. Or this big tower and big shift could be this person coming out and expressing their emotions and their feelings for you. Somebody likes your lips is what I'm getting with this lip service. We have the Ace of Cups. Yeah, the lovers. I'm getting friend, friends, lovers and friends. <laughs> I'm here. Uh, what is that? Usher and Lord John. Is that is that that song? Lovers and friends. Yeah, it's Usher, and I think Lord John on there. That song is playing in my head. I don't know. Yeah. So that could be significant for someone, but. interesting I'm getting somebody whoa there is there a fight I feel like there's a fight or some sort of competition here with the five of wands it's just it just seems like whoa okay so I'm getting like two different storylines from this Somebody could be, like, professing their love to you. This could be a friend. I'm getting fight. a fight. It's breaking out. What the fuck is going on here? Five of Wands. I don't know why I'm getting, like, there's a fight or, some, or, like, a lot of conflict, competition here. Five of Wands. But I'm getting, like, Some sort of fight. What the hell is this? Something breaks out here. It's because it's like with the Queen of Swords, she's looking toward this Five of Wands. This could be people it, people coming out of their shell or expressing their love to you. This could be friends here. I'm getting somebody, yeah, I'm getting, because no wonder why I'm getting forceful and shy. Somebody, this could be somebody that's usually shy coming out or expressing how they feel wanting to be with you now you could already be in a situation i don't know why i feel like what the hell this is this is this is juicy okay i'm getting like like two two or three different storylines things are happening really fast here okay for some of you this could be a friend <clears throat> maybe you guys start off as friends and it's leading to more Maybe this person wants, I'm getting marriage. Person wants marriage, but I don't know why I'm getting like some sort of fight breaks out. What the fuck is this? With this five of wands, conflict, tension, like some sort of sh shift or change here. Or maybe you have a falling out with a friend. I'm getting somebody could be getting married here. Wow, I'm getting like a lot of different stories. Like, uh, so just take whatever resonates because this is all over the place here. I feel like somebody is going to be coming into union or you could be coming into union here. Um, and we have springtime, the spring. So that could be significant for you. But I'm getting like somebody is coming into union and then there's like a fucking somebody competing or a fight breaks out like that's when i'm getting like what is this it's like it's a it, there is a, a potential for new love okay new love two people coming together and then somebody it could be this queen of swords but somebody just comes from out of nowhere and expresses their emotions and feelings either for you or somebody that you're dealing with and it's like what the fuck like I, i'm just getting like a fight breaks out whoa that's what i'm getting yeah because somebody being very forceful aggressive and it could be this queen of swords i mean she do got that sword in her motherfucking hand but i'm getting like somebody just comes out with how they feel 
strong and aggressive. But I'm getting like, yeah, that's why I said this could be like more than one storyline here. But I'm getting a potential of like love, marriage, okay? But I'm getting like some sort of fight breaks out or some 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 shit like that. Somebody just coming out like very strong and to the point like, you know, and but it's competition here, five of wands. So it's like either somebody is not happy that you're getting married or their ex person is not happy that somebody, yeah, it's like somebody coming in strong. Okay. What the fuck is this? Wow. This kind of reminds me of um this little clip video I saw. I think somebody, a, a man and a woman was getting married and the side chick just came out of nowhere and just was like, oh, you, that's how you feel? You was just in my bed. <laughs> the, like, this shit just start, fights just start breaking out. Like, what the fuck is going on here? Like... This is supposed to be a happy moment, you know. This is your moment. Found finding true love here. And then all of a sudden, like something, somebody just comes out with some crazy shit out of nowhere, is what I'm getting. Somebody could be secretly in love with you. I'm getting all types of shit. This is this is real like, yeah, that's what I'm getting. Like somebody getting married, and then somebody comes. Other people just, it could be more than one person comes out of the woodwork and just like, whoa, this is like too much for me. We're going to leave it here. Okay. Um, I like, I love doing these random pick a card readings, but whoa, honey. Mm. Yeah. Like we're going to leave it there. <laughs> we got air energy here. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, water energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. And we also have Earth here. So I'm getting like all the elements are here. Wow. So if this one resonated with you in any way, like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you next time. All right, you guys. So for those of you who chose Pile 3, let's get into your random message. So you have one-sided, confronted. Ooh, spirit of the book, new chapter, development, unfinished business, support, lean on your inner circle during this time. We have love chords interesting okay you have love lyrics so love chords love lyrics this definitely could be surrounding love here okay casual dating interesting okay we have mind possession po oh okay possessiveness sorry about that hold on this was my phone let me um i'm sorry about that you guys hold on low it okay <laughs> we have the king of pentacles earth energy taurus virgo capricorn we got the king of swords whoa two masculine energies here king of swords could be a same sex relationship as well um six of pentacles and we have the eight of wands interesting wow Okay, so first of all, we got a lot going on here, okay? We have a lot going on. I'm getting like more than one storyline right off the bat just by the feel of these cards. Give me one second. Okay, so this is standing out to me first. Love chords and love lyrics getting there's definitely some sort of oh somebody could have a love for music as well as what i'm hearing okay now we have one-sided confident oh yeah i'm getting this is definitely a same-sex relationship or something of that sort um look but it looks like it's only from like one-sided somebody hasn't fully come out yet here is what i'm getting Okay, because you got one person who's feeling very confident and the other person is feeling like they can't really be them true selves here. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I'm getting somebody needs to come out here is what I'm getting. So if this is resonating with you, because I'm getting like somebody casually dating, okay? Somebody casually dating. If this is not um, some of you who, uh, I mean, this is not a same-sex 
relationship, then this could be you dealing with two um, masculine energies here. We got the King of Pentacles and the King of Swords. Okay, so I had to pause the camera because I'm getting like more than, I'm getting like more than one storyline. So for those of you who, you know, this doesn't resonate with as far as a um, same-sex relationship, then that's not for you. But I'm getting another storyline here with this reading, with this pile. There is, I feel like you could be currently with either one of these energies. I'm getting it could be the King of Pentacles. This earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, um, stable energy. I'm getting this could be somebody that you're dating that or that you be that you are casually dating. This person is very giving. They have, they are very, um, they are financially stable. They may give to your children as well. I'm getting finances, but I'm getting, there's another masculine energy here who could be feeling stuck, um, feeling not as confident here. Maybe, maybe due to the lack of finances, um, this person still may have a lot of love for you here. They may feel that you are their possession. This could be somebody from your past. This could be maybe, uh, somebody that you have children with or something of that sort. There is two masculine energies here. And I feel like one of these energies are like, you're connected to this person, maybe because of the children. And there is somebody else that you have that is very financially giving. Like, they're very grounded. They could be a business owner as well. Something about music. So, this part, I'm getting a producer. Somebody loves music or they write music. They are an, an artist or somebody writes music or produces music is what I'm getting. Okay? Um, that's what Spirit wanted me to speak on here. Is this person do, does music here. They write or they play music or they do some sort of instrument. They do something with music. They have a, a, a love for music here is what I'm getting. Um, this person is very talented as well. But I'm getting like you may have to make a decision because I feel like these two energies may clash here. Um, the King of Pentacles and the King of Swords here. I feel like there's two masculine energies that's in that's in your life or one one could have been a part of your life in the past, but I'm getting this person still has or feels that you are their possession. That's what I'm getting due to children. But I'm getting you could be casually dating this earth sign towards Virgo Capricorn. This person is, I'm getting music. This person is definitely going to be, they're really great with music. Like they have a lot of resources or something like that. But I'm getting this other masculine energy definitely could be feeling not as confident here. Um, this is someone that wants to communicate with you, Eight of Wands. I feel like this person still has love for you. My camera is getting ready to cut off, you guys. But like I said, this person definitely wants to still speak their truth and they feel like you are theirs. So I feel like you're going to have to make a decision. You may have to have your inner circle, like lean on them for support as well. Um, this air sign may also feel blocked. Okay. Yeah. This person could be from your past. So we got earth energy towards Virgo Capricorn, air energy, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, all the elements here. If this one resonated with you in any way, like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye.